Galatians 2.20, I've been crucified with Christ. It is no longer I who live, but Christ who lives in me. And the life which I now live in the flesh, I live by faith in the Son of God, who loved me and gave himself for me. Yeah, surrender, right? I mean, that's, that's the trick, but the whole die to yourself thing is, is what's hard to figure out. Surrendering to God is like, is, is essentially submitting to the governing authority to the Most High King. Surrendering my life to God means, um, you know, just, just changing who I am. You see, it's that very act of giving up self. The life that I used to live is no longer the life that I live now. To lay down your own will, to lay down your own thoughts, your own desires. Essentially, um, it means changing who I was, uh, changing who my friends were, um, willingly, not just be feeling like I was forced to do so. You're taking your, the life you used to live and just throwing it to the side and saying, God, all I am is for you. I mean, surrender is not really in the plan. You're never on the battlefield like, all right, we're gonna go out there, give it a good fight. Uh, it's probably gonna get a little tough and, and then we'll surrender. That moment when, when you realize that the way I'm doing things, it isn't gonna work out. You know, when you come to know Christ and you surrender your life to him, you truly surrender your life to him, you, uh, um, you have a desire to change. To let him live through you, to become a living vessel, a tool for the kingdom of God. I surrender to the direction and purpose he has for my life. And I have a desire to do that because he, he, he knows exactly where my life's going and he has the perfect plan for my life. It's something I can't even come close to. The Bible says that the one who, who is after to save his life will lose it, but the one who loses his life for the sake of Christ will find it. It's no longer about my wants or my desires or the things that I look for. It's all about God. So following God is, is my desire. You put down the weapon, you stop the fight and say, I'm all yours. For you have died and your life is hidden with Christ in God. And then to get to that point of surrender, only to have to do it again the next day.